It's part of Christine Donovan's job to talk to people who've seen ghosts here. They don't even like talking to me. You know, they hate to even tell me what happened because they think I'll think they're, you know, out of their minds. You know the story of Kate Morgan. She checked into the Hotel Dell in 1892, was later found shot on steps leading down to the beach. They say her room is haunted. Absolutely. I mean, absolutely her room. We know the room she stayed in. This room, 3327. Christine hears from folks who've experienced strange things in here and other places in the hotel too. Unexplained noises, unexplained breezes, unexplained changes in temperature, that sort of thing. And that's typical ghost activity. Through the years, she's talked with dozens of people. Everyone has their own story, you know. So how does she determine what's just crazy and what might be something real? I frequently hear stories that seem just too far-fetched to me. A man said he shared a meal and a leisurely conversation with a ghost at the hotel. She didn't buy it, but then there was the couple who stayed here. And actually, in the middle of the night, a ghostly figure ripped the covers off their bed, which I later came to find is a typical ghost antic. So you think Christine's anxious to see a ghost herself here? Maybe stay in Kate Morgan's old room? No thanks. Because I have talked to too many people that have been there and have seen things, and I just have no desire to be face to face with a ghost. Even if it would make a great story about San Diego. One couple staying in that supposedly haunted room reported that the television set suddenly turned itself off and the doors on the TV cabinet slammed shut. Must have been watching something other than PBS. 